Now, please, look at me. thinks you're nuts i've decided to do a little investigation on my own now supposedly when you look into these cards they truly reveal what's really going on in your mind so you're a psychiatrist now well kind of and you're one very disturbed little vampire forget it i see a big black blob Change your mind? Yes, I've changed my mind. All right. So tell me what you see. I see the naked bodies of two young lovers in a passionate embrace as they breathlessly make love again and again. Really? Let me show you. apologize for my behavior oh, no. no apologies are necessary now where were we what are you doing man you were such a cheese Meryl what are you talking about one minute it's on you're kissing me and the next minute Murdoch's right you are nuts Recognize this? It's your black shirt. You couldn't borrow it, so you had to cut it to pieces? I would never do that. Do I have to keep my clothes under lock and key? Is that it? Essie, you better sort out your issues real fast, Meryl. I didn't do it, I swear. Let's talk about it. It's true, Essie didn't loan me her shirt. But I would never. So you're not angry with her? Okay. Yes, I was. And I know where you're going with this, but... How does it explain Marty? Sexuality is another part of ourselves that we often repress. <sighs> so you're saying I have those feelings for Marty? <laughs> you know, there's a positive side to all this inconsistent behavior. Really? All those emotions you've repressed are finally showing themselves. But why now? Sometimes there's a trigger. Could be trauma. Guilt. What is it? Nothing. How did you feel when Sherry died? How did you feel when Sherry died? I heard the question. You knew how much Drew loved her, didn't you? What are you saying? That I wanted her dead? Did you? This whole thing is one big waste of time. She was ruining the experiment. She was ruining something else, wasn't she? What are you implying? I want you to look inside yourself, Mara. Tell me what's going through your mind right now. 
I used to fantasize about Sherry being dead. Her being out of Drew's life and mine. Yeah, I wished her dead. Everyone has dark thoughts from time to time. You don't understand? I killed her. Meryl, reading minds is one thing, but a burst appendix. You don't know what I'm capable of. There's evil in all of us. Well, I don't want that side of me. None of us can deny our dark side. We have to embrace it. I'd like to be alone now. I'm sure Dr. Hatch.